one. Can you spell Umbreon? Okay, let's go. Unibrom. <laughs> we have Master WGS versus Strong Death. This is actually a pretty good second, saying how early this is. Yeah. <laughs> So this is quarters. This is quarters. What do we have, like eight people? 23. <laughs> we have 23 people. <laughs> All right, oh. we got 23 people. All right. So we're getting to this next one. Um, so I talked to you uh, a little bit about this character. I, I was out in uh, Houston, and I played Bowser, and I actually really enjoyed it. Bowser's so fun. Yeah, <laughs> Bowser's so a lot good. of things. And, well, I don't know if he's good. He it's hits more like he's fun. He, yeah, you're right. You're right. He's, he's uh, really something that you enjoy picking up and playing. It's straightforward, but there's some intricacies. There's small little things that you can learn about. He has a lot of character-specific stuff that gives you a lot of free marketing. That's pretty important to keep in mind because I think a lot of people underrate the character because they don't respect him. <laughs> yeah, because they're like, it's Bowser, right? Yeah. It's irrelevant in Melee, right? Now, I will say that Bowser is supposed to have a hard time with this matchup because of how Bite just does do the thing more. Yeah, I mean, you're this massive hurt box, right? And he just... You you get set up on top of a platform, hey, let me take a bite out of you. And well, you actually, well, that's a mixed bag, because if you're Bowser, you don't really want people on top of your body box to begin with. Mm. You know, that's what up B is for, you escape that. Mm. Does, well, but uh, but neutral B from, comes up a little bit short there, but neutral B from uh, Wario will beat out up B from, from uh, Bowser, correct? No. <laughs> it you loses. Don't, you, don't, you don't beat out Bowser's up B. <laughs> it's that good. Well, it's... I wouldn't say it's good at the point it's mandatory. The character needs an option like that. Yeah. Yeah. Especially considering like the lack of mobility and the lack of dash dance game around the character. Yeah, like he he, has, he definitely has some tricks to play to, but he's yeah. relatively inflexible in his game plan. Mm. So you absolutely needed that emergency out button. It's like it's like a burst from like Guilty Gear. Yeah. yeah. You know okay. what I'm talking about. You yeah, need, I do. Can can you imagine playing that game without that? No. Okay then. <laughs> <laughs> That's sick. That's disgusting. That that putrid vile vomit. Uh, that future part. Just crapping all over. Yeah, dude. Shout out to Strong Bad getting third at tipped off. Yeah, dude. Make, I, making some Giffy Cats along the way. I, I, the second I saw him, I was like, winner. He's like, I didn't win. I was like, you made rent money, homie. Yeah, he, <laughs> he made more than rent money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he, Good he for got, him. He went, he went to uh, Sonic and got 40 corn dogs. Holy. That sounds like a Strong Bad thing you do, though. <laughs> you know your fad is words I can't say on stream. <laughs> <laughs> Charging the forward throw, tries to box him out with the backer. No, he could have held ledge. He would have been fine. Good finish. They're, they're talking in the player camp. They're having a good time. Oh, as they should. You that, played a couple games with this guy, haven't you? I played him first thing I walked in. What do you think about this guy? Uh, what are some things that you noticed? What are things that he can work on? For a Bowser player, he has surprisingly more defensive pulls than you'd imagine. Mm. Um, but he also does a lot of character-specific tech that's really good to throw you off. Interesting. So it's kind of a big, yeah, like he's a little bit more dangerous than most Bowser players, but kind of easier to take out as well. Volatile. Yeah. When so he hurts you, he hurts you. But when he gets taken, he gets taken down pretty hard. Well, that's the thing. Adam is kind of, Strong Bad is kind of the same way where... Adam has a fantastic punishment game, mm. but doesn't always play neutral that clean. Mm. So I wouldn't be surprised to see them trading stocks in this match. Interesting. Cool. I'm excited to see more of it. <coughs> so first game taken by Strong Bad. We're getting into game two. Um, now we're going over here to Delfino Secret. I remember when we first started talking about the stage. You're like, I love it. Like, oh, I love. Yeah, I love the stage where I did testing in 3.5. Yeah, it's fantastic. The thing is, normally Bowser's really good at small stages, uh -huh. and I'm not sure why he picked this. Yeah, it, it does seem kind of odd because when I'm Bowser, uh, I like trapping someone, right? And yeah. if the stage helps me do that, then great. I get to put out my normals and poke at you a lot easier, right? Because there's two ways I feel like you can play neutral. Um, where it's... So in Street Fighter, it's it's kind of like I use my normals to control the areas and use threatens and threaten with that. And then they constantly actually have these threats in their mind, right? Sure. Versus um, the dash sense centric game where it's like weaving in and out of these situations. Oh, he did jab reset and he was going to follow up with another command grab? It's, yeah, it's really good. Uh, Adam just kind of tucked out of it. I think it could have been a little tighter. Mm, there's a punish back throw. Yeah, the thing is that you, Bowser's form of stage control is very unique because what Bowser does is he's big and fat and in your way and all of a sudden you have to worry about the fact that he could attack you and he can just hold position and kind of force you to the edge. Playing against Bowser at the edge is really, really hard. I mean, that's for every character. There's yeah. a, you just can't escape him at that point. So why he picked this stage is kind of odd because that kind of downplays that advantage. Although he might know something I don't. I'm, true. Not, I'm not the Bowser expert. True, 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 true. You know, it, it makes me think of like almost Zangief in some, so, some sort of aspect. Yeah. Because when you think of Zangief, you think of this guy, or, or Hugo even, you know, these super massive burly people that, that take up a large portion of the screen and 
you are constantly scared of an of an imminent threat of a command grab, right? So with Bowser, how important do you feel like his side B is? Now that I mean it's a little bit more remade this time around, right? Uh, I like Bowser's side B in that it keeps people honest because when you see Bowser's attacks, you say, okay, well, that's slow and lagging does damage. I'm going to block this. And Bowser's side B is just an essential part of getting around that. There, there's really no get. Okay, that was gross. <laughs> there's really no. Bowser needs that kind of counterplay, though. Mm. God, up smashes. Just got, we're just swinging and for the fence. He's here. exactly where he was last game, though. He's down a stock, two to one. Yeah. Mm. Back here? Oh, there it is. Bear. I, I think he could get something going, but I don't think he's gonna win the match. Yeah, I think it, I think he's he's on the he's on the start of something. And before you guys say, oh the commentary is biased, I don't give a crap about have biased commentary. <laughs> Eat it. <laughs> I'll keep it at 100. <laughs> so uh I think it I not but I think a, a lot of it's fair is because you know we don't see often a lot of uh, Bowser's out there, right? Right. Uh, well he's got the edge guard. Bowser's uh and he punts it. He's good, he's good. No, he's really not good. He really needed that kill bad. Oh! Because now he's just going to be taking damage trying to get Wario off stage. Is he done? Yeah, yes. he's done. Okay. okay, 42. I didn't think that would kill on this stage. Wario's heavy. Interesting. Let's see what, what, what we're getting there. But right now, Strong Bad's looking like it's my turn to show you something, homie. I don't know. It could go either way. I, I'm also highly under the opinion that ba that Adam is not in try-hard mode after uh, Atlanta. I mean, he did. He did a lot of work. Yeah. I mean, I might be wrong. I might be wrong. I'm not going to discount uh, Grant, but that's that's my impression. Ooh, drop down back air. It's going to be a simple edge guard down tilt back air. I think he. Yeah. He's done. That was fun. Just wait. <laughs> Get the position. Keep the position. Deck him.